Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we're going to show you how to replace the master window switch, the driver's front window switch on this 2003 Honda Civic. Uh, many times the switches on these cars, they get wet uh, and short out. Um, it's a pretty fairly straightforward uh, replacement and it is a similar procedure for any 01 to 05 Civic. The tools you'll need are a small flat blade screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and a door panel clip tool or a putty knife uh, to help to pry the door panel off. Move your door panel, start up here and pull firmly on that piece of trim. A small screwdriver right at the top Inside your door handle, is a little, you'll see a little indent, a little door that comes down. Okay, now use a screwdriver or just your fingernails and pull off this panel right here. Just pull firmly out of the front and it comes off. And then there are two Phillips screws in here and right in here. Need to remove those. And I'll speed up here as I remove those screws. Uh, again, just using a Phillips screwdriver and get those out. Sometimes they don't come all the way out of the door. Uh, that's fine, just when you pull the door panel off, uh, just watch where they might drop out. Uh, and after you do those, then there are two screws right in that door handle. Remove those. There's a little tab on the back of your door lock switch. Press the tab, disconnect. There's a clip that holds the door lock rod on. You can use a screwdriver or your finger. Push the clip off, pull the rod up and off. And then there's a little tab right here for your power window switch. Press that. Disconnect your power window switch. Now, using a door panel clip tool, get right in behind here, up until you meet a clip, pull it out, go around the clip. While doing that, a couple clips came off. Just slide the clips right back in place. There. And one right down here. And on the inside of your door panel, to remove the switch, there are three screws here. Remove them. And speed up the film here as I remove those first uh, three screws. And then on the other side, there are two more. Now this panel comes out. Separate the top here, pry out on a couple little tabs. Comes right off. 
it out with three screws. And you switch from one auto, exactly the same as the old one. Goes right in. I'll speed up. Uh, notice I feed each screw in, start it by hand first, uh, then go through and tighten them up with the screwdriver and tighten them up firm. You don't want to over tighten them though. Tab right here. Make sure that goes under. Bring it down. Pull it over. Snap it right together. Speed up here as I put the four screws that go on the back side. Uh, I kind of feed them in by hand first, make sure they're started, uh, and then tighten them up nice and firm. And then turn your panel over and do the same thing for the two screws on the outside. Fast forward here is I put those uh, two screws that hold the door handle in place back in, tighten them up firmly. Put the harness up and these two Phillips screws. and speed it up again as I install the two screws that hold the door pull uh, part of the panel in place. Okay. Put the back in first and then snap it right on. Okay, the two little tabs go on the bottom. Snap that in place. We hope this helps you out. Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.